Hello. So today we are back with more of Dad's weird food shenanigans. Uh, uh, this time he has to ruin his favorite fruit, though, which happens to be a mango. I picked up a few mangoes and I told him, look, ruin this. I mean, try weird things with this. So I set out a couple of weird things and Dad has to taste them. So here are Dad's, um, I would say ingredients, but that's garlic not really it. Powder. He has to try it with mustard. He has to try it with garlic powder. He's got to try it with cinnamon, and he's got to try it with a slice of American cheese. Because he tried to ruin my pineapple, you guys. So this that time... is not cheese. This is plastic. <laughs> okay, so you have to try it with a slice of plastic. Uh, so I suggest you get started slicing your mango, sir. You know what? I'm, I'm all about trying everything once, and I'm not afraid of trying weird things, so. For anybody who's never tasted a mango, mm. tastes mostly like the inside of a tree smells. <laughs> no, so if you get a fresh pine tree, uh, slice it open and smell it, that's what a mango no, tastes it's like. it's not. It's sweet and tender and delicious. Tender. Yeah, it's sweet and tender and tastes like the inside of a pine tree. No, it doesn't. Okay. It's nice and yellow. So there's a big, fat, flat seed inside. How do you know which direction the seed goes before you cut it open? You don't. You just guess. Really? There's no way to know? No, not that I know. Hmm. Mm. So first up, we're going to decorate each of these four slices <laughs> with something pretty. Decorate. <laughs> so Look, we're going to put a nice, plastic. nice hunk of plastic. We'll stick that hunk of plastic on this one. <laughs> Here we go. And I'll eat that, cause yum. yum. And then I'll decorate one with this. Cinnamon? I like that you call it decorate. Here we go. I'm actually looking forward to that one. Yeah, that one's cinnamon. Um, and then I'll decorate one with this. <laughs> there we go. And I'll make the last one super pretty by giving it a <laughs> nice coating of mustard. You're gonna intensify the yellow color of mm -hmm. the mango? Mm -hmm. Let's see if I miss. <laughs> I knew I was gonna miss. It's hard to aim because you don't know where it's gonna come out. Jeez. Right. Wow, it's a lot. Hey, I said it was gonna be decorated. It there. Looks, it looks gross. It looks better camera. from this angle. There, that's it looks nice. Gold in the camera. It looks like gold. That's in pretty. It's pretty. Okay, pick a number between one and four. Can I go with my favorite number? Two. All right. You're having garlic first. That's what I was thinking too. <laughs> garlic mango. Garlic mango. Well, garlic and mango are used in uh, like Thai food and Vietnamese food, I think. I wouldn't smell it. I would just go for it. It doesn't smell good. There it goes. It's not disgusting. It's not good so you're not gonna be getting the garlic out next time you eat a mango and be like, oh, this no. is the best. No. All right. Number between one and three. Three. Okay, you're having cheese. Blech. That's what I was thinking too. Plastic. Great. Ah, that plastic is so gross. Ah. No. We should have tried cheddar cheese because you like cheddar cheese, I I and it like may that. have been something you liked if you had actually liked the topping, yeah. so, okay. Uh, actually, it's not terrible. Dad doesn't like American cheese, but he does like cheese in his hot chocolate. Oh, yes. So, Mozzarella. he is a little mm. weird with cheese, just apparently doesn't like American cheese. Even though he is now oh. American, he should like American cheese. If you guys have never tried pieces of mozzarella cheese in your hot chocolate, you're missing out. Make sure it's nice and hot, put a couple of pieces in it, let it melt and then grab it with a spoon and a fork. Oh, so good. Okay. I'm gonna go with number one. Oh, so Which one do you think you're having? The mustard one. No. No? Cinnamon? You oh. get cinnamon. Oh, that was Cinnamon good. is that's, next. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be delicious. It's funny because now you have to end on mustard. <laughs> Cinnamon Cinnamon? Are you gonna be getting the cinnamon out next time you have a mango and putting cinnamon on it? Not really. The only thing I like with my mango is salt. That's salt? It. Mm hmm 
Oh yeah, you just put, get a slice of, uh, man of mango with a little bit of salt. Super delicious. Because mm. you get that salt and sweet. I definitely mixture. wouldn't have thought of that. Oh, try it, it's good. Mm. Don't put mustard. It's not Look at well, that. you're about to. Mm. Look at that disgusting thing. <laughs> It looks yummy. <laughs> looks all right, pick it up. Down look, the hatch, Dad. Look, I'm all Dad, about... just imagine oh, look, I'm gonna even gonna scoop that there. All right. <laughs> it's so vinegary. Yeah, mustard's gross. I don't know if you know this mustard about mustard, but mustard dog. mustard is gross. Corn dog and ketchup, that's where they go. Not in the mango. Watermelon. And watermelon. See, you said it wasn't bad on watermelon. Now you gotta try it on your very favorite thing. You know what's good with watermelon? Ketchup. I'm still sticking with that. That was really good. Oh, you should put ketchup. All right, we're getting ketchup out too. You could try ketchup on your mango. All right. Three, two, one, down the hatch. <laughs> Do you like mustard with your tree sap? Really You're good. pausing before speaking. That's pretty gross. Yeah, it's because it had mustard on it. And it was on a mango. <laughs> uh, mustard mustard and mango, not so much? Gross. No. So that means next is ketchup? Yes. Ugh. You hey, you asked for it. You specifically requested ketchup. <laughs> I'm gonna be pleasantly surprised that it's good. You're gonna see. <laughs> ketchup! Yeah, I don't know what other kind of ketchup there is. Maybe there is. Mm. <laughs> that looks vile. You gotta smear it. Uh, <laughs> you gotta get all the corners, just uh, like you like your butter, your butter in the toast. Yeah, you gotta get the butter all the way to the edges on toast. I do stand by that, but this looks disgusting. You gotta get the ketchup on Three, the two, one, down the hatch. God, this is gonna be so disgusting. Mmm! <laughs> you tried really hard to pretend like you liked it, didn't you? This is actually good <laughs> again. Oh, come on! Ketchup and fruit are actually really good. No. Uh, yeah. You're pretending because you think, I'm no. gonna trick somebody else into tasting this uh, nasty absolutely thing. Absolutely not. So, That's actually good. So the next time you go and get a mango, you're gonna be putting ketchup on it? No! Mmm! Oh it's actually good! Mmm! I love it. There's something wrong with you. <laughs> okay, Dad, you've gone through the gauntlet of trying all the things with your mango. Um, which was your favorite thing with your mango? That's absurd. None of these should be good. Cinnamon was the only one that I was thinking, okay, well, maybe that wouldn't be so bad. Yeah, and I'm not a really big fan of ketchup, like in fries. Apparently you are. You like it on all your fruit. I like it in fruit. I don't like it in my food. That's disgusting. <laughs> Ugh. The littlest guinea pig wants to try some of this weird stuff. So you're going to try garlic or cheese or ketchup. Which one are you going to try? Cinnamon. Cinnamon? You could try ketchup. It is really Dad delicious. says it's good. It's delicious. All right, cinnamon it is. Let's try cinnamon by itself. No, cinnamon by itself is not good. No, it's not good. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> mm, cinnamon mango. Mango. Cinnamon mango. Cinnamon mango. One. Is that a flavor? Three, two, one. That's good. You like cinnamon with your mango? Oh, do you think that's good? Wait a minute, dude. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You gotta try it. Just a, a bite. Mm -mm, mm -mm. <laughs> there you go. Imagine like it's a French fry. Look, it's kind of shaped like a French fry and looks like a French fry. No, that doesn't look anything like a French fry. It's just a big French fry. All right, Jackson. No, this is a big French fry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, open wide. Try it. Down dude. the hatch, bro. Let's Trust me, it. it's not bad. Let's just have a bite of it. it. You don't have to eat the whole thing. Just have a bite of it. I'll do it. Okay, you do it. I'll hold it. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, your lie was just exposed. Oh, Look at him. <laughs> that face says Dad lied. Did it's Dad lie? Is it good or did Dad lie? <laughs> Dad lied. Dad lied. <laughs> it's good. Jax, hmm. how's a mango and ketchup? How's a mango and cinnamon? Good. How's just mangoes? Amazing. 
You don't like mangoes anymore? No. <laughs> that makes sense. I don't like mangoes anymore, I can I tell like you that. Okay. Watching dad eat mangoes with ketchup and mustard and garlic and blah, blah. Look, nope. I'm at a neutral state with mangoes. I've had a couple really good mangoes and I've had a couple of mangoes that like were terrible. Yeah, so. so dad is um, always trying something new and uh, he's not afraid to put anything in his mouth. He says, yep, I'll taste that. Okay. I won't do it again if it's not good, but I'll taste anything. I like and Jackson. That are new, but like, not, the, not like that. Not things yeah, that's, that that's just <laughs> gross. Jackson was actually brave enough to try a couple of them. He was talked into tasting the ketchup with the mango, but he actually wanted to taste the cinnamon with the mango. So... Good job, little guinea pig. Uh, but guys, I need to put my smarty pants to bed. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to make this channel strong, share it with your friends. And a good night, YouTube. See you till next time. Okay, subscribe. Please subscribe now. Poof. That's crazy because you like that ketchup with mango. Is it yucky? <laughs>